Hello everyone, Michael here, and today I'm going to be showcasing my new plugin, Beveler. Ironically, the most popular video on my scripting based channel is a building tutorial teaching this concept, so I decided to create an automated way using scripting to accomplish this task. The link to the plugin is in the description if you'd like to get it. The plugin is listed under my group's name. The rest of this video will be demonstrating how to use the plugin and what it can do. After you install the plugin, head over to the Plugins tab where you can find it under the title Beveler. There are two options that you can choose from, Bevel Object and Settings. In the Settings widget, you can change the corner size that you want the currently selected part to have. You don't even have to set the corner size before clicking Bevel Object if you want the default corner size to take effect, but the Settings widget allows you to customize the intensity of the rounded corners for parts. After you have selected your desired corner size, you can press the Bevel Object button to add rounded corners to the part. This only works on block parts, so no bevel spheres, which means that you should make further customizations to the part after beveling. This plugin's beveling feature preserves the main properties of parts, such as size, position, name, brick color, transparency, and material. All children and objects inside of the part are moved into a folder while the part is being beveled and are placed back in the part afterwards. By preserving features of the original part, the plugin allows developers to transfer their hard work on that part to a beveled solution with a minimal amount of extra tweaking. And since the plugin uses Roblox's solid modeling system to negate and union the parts together, the changes can be reversible by pressing undo and trying again differently. Hopefully this plugin will help expedite the process of making beveled corners on objects and make Roblox development easier for everyone.